Yeah, he's been like moving. He's had to move around and stuff like that too. So right, it's right. Definitely hard to come out to stuff. But you know what? If someone makes the call that SoCal sucks, then <laughs> the the elegant shall be summoned. Yeah, if and he, I mean, if he needs to be, it's always fun to watch uh, elegant Luigi too, right? Uh, Luigi, yeah. not the. Uh, I want to say the, the most popular or common character you're going to see in uh, tournament brackets. In SoCal, it kind of is just because we have an influence we have, being we have elegant. Bo we have both, like, very influential Luigis <laughs> right, in right. our region. So, so. so I, I've fought a decent amount of mm -hmm. Luigis in bracket. I, I know there's other Luigis as well. I know um, Doc Poe plays a little Luigi, yeah. mainly like Diddy as of recently. But he yeah. has Luigi. There's um, a bunch of Luigis in – or not a bunch, but there are Luigis like – on the East Coast, Tri-State. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I think that Luigi is definitely worse than he was in Smash 4. Oh, 100%. Yeah, but, but. he's still good. Like, right. He, right. He, he's not going to win or get second at a like a Super Major anytime soon, but he can definitely like ruin someone's day. That, that's like the category I like to put him in. Like, yeah. Ruin someone's day potential. It's kind of like DK. You know, you, you can get your day ruined, like Ken did a couple weeks ago. <laughs> are, are you trying to fun it up right now? <laughs> ruin? Ruin. Am so I? That, the guy that beat him was Runes. That was his tag. Oh. Dang, oh, yeah, know, yeah. You oh, know. yeah. I wasn't, I, I'm so good with puns, man, that <laughs> I don't even realize when I'm doing them. That's just how good I am. <laughs> All right, so Elegant warm himself up. This this matchup is it's pretty rough. I believe the last time they fought was at Genesis Black, which is a uh, Genesis tournament. that and uh, Genesis is usually in NorCal, but they did a um, – tournament called Genesis Black in SoCal. Yeah. So that was a really uh, fun tournament. They It was actually these two in Grand Finals. So that was the last time they played. It was uh, pretty tough. Uh, I mean, Luigi's had... Luigi just has trouble versus swords and, like, characters with immense range and incredible offstage. Everything I just listed is So So uh, <laughs> you can imagine it's going to be pretty rough. But Elegant has... You know, he, he's someone that just sticks sticks to his guns. And he, he'll play it out. Even in Smash 4... There was a lot of matchups that Luigi just struggled in, right? And he, he just persevered through them. He just played them out. He's got really good at those matchups. Yeah, you always got to consider that even without the... Uh, he's dead. <laughs> yeah. You got to even consider, like, even on paper, like, you got to remember, you're, we're playing human beings. Like, yeah. a mistake's bound to happen somewhere, and you can get a bit... And a character like Luigi just thrives off of people's mistakes, you know? So, yeah, you just got to be careful about that. Luigi's definitely one of those characters where I feel like you, you low-key get buffed in tournament. Yeah. <laughs> Just because you have that fear factor, right? Exactly, yeah. Okay, so Elegant trying to pressure on this platform. The reversal gets the shield art, or tries to get the shield art, but I don't think it got off the time. And that's going to be one thing that, uh, another thing that's really good about this matchup is shield art is going to be able to kind of nullify down B kills almost, like kind of, sort of, you know? Mm -hmm. I mean, Shield Arch is generally good against multi-hit moves that have, like, a killing blow at the end. Oh, man, that was really nice. To use the tip of Darren to send him to the side so he's able to get the stock anyway. With the Smash Art as well. Yeah. So, oh, a lot of kill power to back that up. Shield Art online here, not going to do too much. He survives, but he's still on the ledge here. The down smash, wow, the Nico with the fastball there, not able to connect it. What's the punish? Grab. Ooh, a little slow on the fastball there. Might have been able to get a punish. Man, Elegant's still struggling to find his first stock. Never mind. Give him the chops. Yeah. This yeah, is so a slap to the face. This is, this is what Luigi, he, he had to resort to going that hard to get the stock. Yeah. You know what I mean? All right. Oh, but a big opportunity. Yeah, big combo. Oh. There we go. 77. I don't know if Nico messed up the shield art or, like, tried to pump fake the shield art. Like, oh, I'm going to switch. Not really. <laughs> yeah. he, he just took, seven, like, 77 for not shield art. Yeah, I don't know, man. If, if you let Elegant get your hands on you, then you just know that you're in for a rough time. Ooh, beautiful sh parry. But he knew he didn't have a fast enough move to, like, follow up on the parry. And look at that beautiful edge guard on the, the green missile. Yeah. And with the smash art on top of that, that's... The, one of the reasons why Choke is so good at edge guarding is forward air. Humongous move. You miss that, you have double jump forward air. You miss that, you got the up B as well. Yeah. They all kill. Mm -hmm. Oh, thank God, man. This is me after the set, okay? <laughs> all right, so going into going game, game two. Yeah, game number two here. Uh, I wonder what the counter pick stage for Elegant here. It looks like town and city is the pick. Yep, same spot as last time. Okay, beautiful frame trap. Gonna get things started off pretty hot here. 44% for Elegant already. Oh, 
big opportunity. Okay, just goes for a quick F smash. Oh, try to catch the landing with the grab there. And it, it's so weird to see, I mean, just coming from Smash 4, the uh, the plunger, the tether grab be used in neutral for the Luigi. Oh, yeah. It's just still a weird sight for me. Okay. But man, look at this. The buster art just really turning things around for this damage output. The back throw, wow, it's so strong. And Ele Elegant has to go for these edge guards. Yeah, I mean, he's got to take every chance he can. And it's just a matter of, well, if he gets it, he gets it. The plunger set up as well, trying to maybe set up a two frame or some kind of trap. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Either like stiffer recovery or something like that. This is what he's going for. Oh, man. He, that was a really good walk back from Elegant, but he walked too far back. Like he just walked off the stage. <laughs> wow. Oh, yeah, that, that back air has been carrying Elegant so far this stock. Like, oh, yeah. He, that long lasting hitbox is just interrupting Nico at the right exact moment. So he's getting super lucky so far. Yeah, because Nico looked like he was cranking in his own back here in that situation. Yeah. That would have been a wrap or very bad position. All right, how's he get around it? Yeah, that, he tried to fake him out again with like an empty hop and get through, but that time Nico was ready for it. He was able to respond with that. Ooh, okay. Gets the forward smash, though. Elegant keeping it very, very close. Even though, like, game one was, like, like not super convincing, but it was pretty convincing. Yeah, using a lot more fireballs and wow, snatching them up from so far away. There's the shield art. Nico not wasting any time on that one. Yeah. <laughs> it's like any chance that the zero to death comes out, you know what? I'm just going to go straight for the shield art. Yeah, and that's another thing that's like pretty rough about this matchup too, because Luigi is a character where it's like it can be hard to get that opening, but once you get it, you get a ton of damage or you yeah. kill him. Like, or you get just. You, you just get a lot off of it, but with shield art, it kind of makes that a little bit more difficult. Yeah. Kind of a get out of jail free card. Oh yeah, for sure. Oh, maybe try to turn it around there, but nonetheless, Elegant will take that. Gets right back on stage where Luigi wants to be. Ooh, wow, yeah. outspacing the tornado as well. Mm -hmm. I like that Nico's like keeping in mind. Ooh. Wow. Oh, but he got the misfire. That actually worked Dude. out so well for him. Elegant has been getting extremely lucky with misfires tonight. It's it's in. Do you mean insane. all the time? No, like, specific. Like, I mean, I mean you, it you, is you all know, the time. You know what I mean, right? But, like, like more than <laughs> usual. More than usual. Damn, even for elegant standards, that got to be a lot then. Yes, it was absolutely crazy. I, who was, I think it was his winner's quarters match. Like, oh, man, he was getting, like, the perfect misfires. Just like that forward that air, man. so good. The turnaround jab immediately to punish before he could get back to ledge because he yeah. was still in the frames from pulling out his last aerial. That was so smart from Elegant. And the positioning there on that edge guard just perfectly met Nico with the forward air. But right now, on the ledge here, the bus are about to run out, but the anti-air, the pressure still coming out here for Nico. Okay, Elegant finally finds his way on the stage after two rolls. Yeah, but uh, how is he going to check? How is he going to catch jump art? That's, that's the main question. You, you just got to accept you're going to take a couple free hits there. Especially on this platform transformation, jump art is so good. Yeah. There, you have so many like high platforms to go to. Well, there's a misfire. Oh, oh man. Oh, man. He needs those double jump, yeah. Okay. Yeah, he saved it all through that, but at what cost, man? At what really? cost? Your life. I'll tell you what, Charles. The stock. Everything. Everything, man. Just like that. 2 0 for Nico, and. Yep. This is, this is tough, man. I don't know if Elig if we're going to see another character come out from Elegant. It just, the matchup looks really rough. He can stick it out with Luigi. I don't. I think he can still do it with Luigi. It's just he has to, those edge guards got to be on the next level for Elegant. And, I mean, we've seen him do it, so we know he can do it. Yeah. But it just has to happen more often. Mm -hmm. And he has to do it before, because once... It just feels like once Nico gets him off stage, he's either going to get edge guard or like ledge trap to oblivion. It's exactly. so tough. Yeah. Luigi true. just has very low air mobility too, so some of his ledge drop, double jump aerial options from the ledge, they're just not as strong because they're not going like too deep into the stage. Right. Like you just don't have that cross up potential. Okay, the punish. Wow, that actually sent into a tech chase scenario. Wow. Wow, that was. That looks true. Rising fair out of shield into the falling Zare into the grab. Mm -hmm. And that's incredible because the the rising fair is an out of shield option. Doesn't get the spike though. Okay. Oh, the, the wow. tech so close from Nico. I was kind of scared that was going to happen just for elegance sake. But you know what? You, you DIM, you can get the tech situation. Oh, but. Wow. Okay. Oh, yeah. right. Sweet. <laughs> <laughs> you know, elegance going to take that. But yeah, I mean, kind of Kalos fighting elegant in the butt right there. Mm -hmm. Um. 
That, that is something you have to take into account. But Nigo just striking right back. Every, even when Elegant gets that situation where he takes the first talk, I just feel like he can't really get anything started to really snowball some kind of lead. Right, yeah. Ooh, beautiful dash away from Elegant. Just get me out. No shield grab, though. The parry, but ooh, yeah, cross good parry, him up. but yeah, cross him up. Bad positioning. Okay, Elegant playing it a little slower. Uh, I, I feel like he's not. I, I don't know. I feel like he's not deciding to play slower. I feel like Nico's kind of forcing him to do that, you know? Yeah. Which is, which is kind of you also difficult him. because, you know, when your opponent's dictating the flow of the match and you can't keep up with it either because of your character or just how the match is going, that shows, like, who's really in control, you know? Right. And the, any moment that Elian tries to speed things up, it's just like Nico's just ready to, like, just swat him out and be like, whoa, slow down. Yeah, he can, my he, he can spend so much time to either go back into jump art and then just go back to the long game, or you can go into shield art and it's like, okay, psych, you had your opening, but it's gone now. So that definitely puts Elegant in a tough position, especially in a game three, sc or third game scenario, down 2-0. Gotta find something, he's gotta dig deep. I like the parry out. fishing from uh, Nico. Can, it somewhat covers, like, get up attack, let's drop double from aerial, right? And wow, there's the smash art kind of betraying Nico there, the up smash from Elegant. Kalos usually with the high ceiling, so mm -hmm. definitely that smash art was a big factor in that. Try to get the, um, the pivot grab there, but the sword is just too long for Elegant. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about, or what you said is rather that even if he gets a lead, it's not for long. So yeah, we're every, back to square one. Every time, I mean, and he's gotten the first stock both times this game, right? Mm -hmm. But Nico is just able to come back from the angel platform, strike back, take no damage. Yeah, and that like sometimes that's like low key a momentum breaker. You know what I mean? It's like, oh, okay, sweet, time to get some extra, and I'm dead. Okay. Okay. You, you know what I mean? It's just it's definitely a buzz kill. Okay, sucks him in. Okay, there's the Nair, tries to convert, but Luigi with the Cyclone, frame one. Smash R, ooh, tries oh, to go for the yeah. drop zone. Cl clutch air dodge, there yeah, we go. Yeah. And I like that he, it was not like a panic directional air dodge, too. He, yeah. He knew what situation he was and just went for that vanilla air dodge, did really, really well there. Mm -hmm. And Elegant desperately trying to find this opening. The shield art, I believe, is still online as well, so. Yeah, he had shield, he had shield and buster when he checked the wheel real quick. Well, let's see. Gets the roll in, okay. Ooh, Ooh. Oh, no oh, way. No. Oh, that's a bummer. And you know what sucks too? Elegant's been getting those down airs, like the the drop zone down airs, 